ever since I was young They said I won't be nothing Now they always say congratulations Worked so hard, forgot how to vacation They ain't never had the dedication What's good YouTube? Easy Breezy here and I'm back with another video and today I want to talk about two centers versus two guards. Which duo is better? Like what's it better to run? I personally ran both and in the gameplay I am running against two guards. Now I am using um, a center and a guard, a stretch and a playmaker. I'm using my playmaker. I have like everything good now. Like all my hot spots, everything like that. So I'm pretty much good on my player and um I just hit the park. So I'm running with my boy B dub and he has a stretch big and I just wanted to see the difference. You guys just saw he got ripped. It's easier number one two guards it's a lot easier to get past the center and even even to guard a center when you can just rip him. Now you guys can see I threw that nice pass to B dub when he did the back door cut and bruh we're just going to, like, literally, I see two guards so much. Like, it feels like people have been doing this more since the 2v2, or the, um, yeah, the 2v2s came back to normal, back to make it, take it. It feels like they've been, um, people have just been using two guards a lot more. And it, it's very, it works a lot. It does work if you do not miss, you know what I mean? If you get the ball and you start off with it and you do not miss at all, but you can't trust 2k to not let you miss. Now, Bruh, I was cooking up this guard, like, he could not guard me, I was shooting a lot of jump shots, and, um, yeah, bro, once I get my grand badge, it's over with, like, center or guard, they're gonna get destroyed, and guard's a lot, e I mean, when you're going up against the center, it's a lot easier to, like, cook them, obviously, because they're a lot more slow, but at the same time, like, when it comes to the paint and everything, it's gonna be a little bit harder. But yeah, you guys can see me pulling the three-pointer. It's literally so easy to shoot. I get so many green lights. And especially once I get my um, grand badge. Well, right here, I, I, I sold for fun. You know what I mean? I, I was just selling. I sold for fun right there, boy. I miss that crap. <laughs> but, I mean, I wanted to do that just so you guys could see how it would be when we're playing defense against, against two guards. So it could be a proper comparison, but at the same time, if two guards can can barely even get the ball, then that shows you that it's not that good. But on the on the defensive side, because centers can just baby guards most of the time, if, especially if they don't have their defense maxed out, you will get babied if you are a guard. And plus, you got to remember the rebounds as well. So it's gonna be hard, but B dubs, it, it's kind of sometimes hard for him to guard the guards just because how fast he is and everything like that. So two guards has the advantage on that, you could say. But for a regular guard versus guard, there's really no advantage. He, that dude should have got blocked right there, but he didn't. But as I was talking about the center, um, when a center is playing defense, he can't play too far up or else the um, guard will blow past him. And if he plays too far back, then you know what I mean, the guard's just gonna shoot the three like he just did. It's very hard to guard, it, it's nasty. But at this point, the guard has just been working the center out. The center cannot guard him at this point, but you already know, I'm not gonna let him get too many points. Eventually, I'm gonna get the stop for the team. Even if the center can't guard him, I'll have to step in, do a little bit of extra work, help out a little bit. So you guys can see, he just cut right there. I picked up, I jumped, and then I went back to my dude. He's broke. My dude barely scored. I think he only scored once or something. I'm not sure. Once or twice, I'm pulling up green light. You already know, once I got that grand badge, I am a sharp shooter. It, it changed, bro, the grand badge helps so much on lockdown defense, shooting, everything. It, the grand, I swear the grand badge helps on like everything, no joke. I don't even know why, like it, it just boosts up your player a bunch. And um, yeah, you guys already know, I'm hard to guard. He cannot guard me, hold up, step back, green light, man. I'm pulling up, that's a green, but now we have to see how good two centers are you know what i mean so i picked up a subscriber and we came on the um two's court and i hit up subscribe like i literally asked people on twitter what's your gamer tag and then if they tell me their gamer tag i'll just um like i tweet it out i say i need a stretch big i need a lockdown i need something and i'll tweet it out and then 
um, I'll add you guys and you guys can run with me for a video or something. Mostly, I do that a lot, so make sure you guys follow me on Twitter and um, maybe you guys like can be in my, one of my videos or get an ad or something like that. Because I do that a lot when I need somebody to run with. But as you guys can see, that dude just got destroyed. He spun off of him. And this is either like two centers or a center and a power forward or something like that. I don't know. They're both like bigs, you can say. And this was one of the downsides to being too big. So you guys see he's posting me up. Probably about to baby me. But no. I literally go in, reach, and get the ball. So that's all you have to do. And I, I most of the time run with stretch bigs. Sometimes glass cleaners. So I just dished it out to him and he got the easy three and it, it's super simple That's really all you have to do. You have to spam that X button or square button or whatever Xbox or PS4 I, I'm still on my Xbox ways. I'm an Xbox player at heart But you know taking my talents to the PS4 and um, yeah, I was out here cooking him up He I mean obviously he can't guard me. He's a center I don't expect him to guard me or a power forward whatever. I don't expect him to guard me at all I mean to be honest, he shouldn't be able to guard a guard. Unless, like, I don't know, he just has lockdown defense or something. But, yeah, he, he couldn't guard me, like I said. I was just taking dunks. Very, very simple game, honestly. One, if, if they get the ball first and we get one stop, like, it's over. The bigs cannot guard me. And, like, only if they have to get, get really lucky. You know what I mean? Like, sometimes they get dumb animations like straight up and they can just get away without getting ripped or whatever like that gets so annoying dude like i i honestly hate that's the thing i hate the most bro i just i just took a crazy dunk right there i don't know how that didn't get blocked but bro i go beast mode when i have my grand badge so hey i'll just blame it on the grand badge that crap's op but look i'm just dropping on pulling up green light you already know that's what happens when i have my grand badge and dude it's super simple so that's the analyzation obviously there are gonna be more better bigs and better guards that we play i mean than than we played you know what i mean there's obviously a lot better centers than what we played today so i mean i don't expect to always be two guards or to always be two centers it it, it goes both ways they're honestly both good I, I might be streaming one day using two guards i might be streaming one day using two centers i have a stretch big and also i have a playmaker as you guys saw me play today but i hope you guys did enjoy i thought this would be a cool video to make drop a like if you did enjoy subscribe for more great quality content have a great day and i am out